Welcome back to City Online. City News reporter Richard Madden and Steve Withers from Vote for MMP. Um, now, with respect to uh, MMP, what a lot of people don't know, your viewers won't know about me, is that actually I have a long history with MMP. Uh, I campaigned for it in New Zealand uh, starting nearly 20 years ago uh, through a several year campaign, and we ended up winning that in 1993, and it's been implemented since 1996. I have lived under an MMP system in New Zealand for the last 11 years. I have voted in four MMP elections. I quit my job earlier this year to come to Ontario to share with people from my native Ontario, where I come from, the truth about MMP. Now, if there was, if any of the stuff being said about it, about MMP by the opponents of MMP was true, I wouldn't have wasted five minutes on it. Now, the Ontario Citizens Assembly know what I know. They voted 94 to 8 in favor of MMP. I quit my job and came here for seven months for no pay to campaign for it. I wouldn't waste my time if those criticisms were true. MMP is absolutely, it provides greater accountability. And let's just start with the local electorate. First, past the post. You get one vote, one candidate, one riding. Most of those votes, those votes don't actually elect anybody. And your vote has absolutely no effect in any other riding. Whereas MMP, you get that vote and a party vote that is in effect a direct vote on the leadership of the party across the entire province. You can vote for one candidate locally and a different party across the whole province. That's something you can't do today. And believe you me, it keeps people accountable. If party bosses loved MMP, they'd be loving it to bits, right? Time for strong words, strong opinions. That's what the show's all about. We'll take another break. We'll be right back. Sam Oliver has finally met the perfect...